A man is at his finest towards the finish of the year. He is almost what he should be when the Christmas season's here. Then he's thinking more of others than he's thought the months before. And the laughter of his children is a joy worth toiling for. He is less a selfish creature than at any other time. When the Christmas spirit rules him, he comes closer to sublime. When it's Christmas, man is bigger and is better in his part. He is keener for the service that is prompted by the heart. All the petty thoughts and narrow seem to vanish for a while, and the true reward he's seeking is the glory of a smile. Then for others he is toiling, and it somehow seems to be that at Christmas he is almost what God wants him to be. If I had to paint a picture of a man, I think I'd wait till it fought his selfish battles and had put aside his hate. I'd not catch him at his labours when his thoughts are all of pelf on the long days and the dreary when he's striving for himself. I'd not take him when he's sneering, when he's scornful or depressed, but I'd look for him at Christmas, when he's shining at his best. Man is ever in a struggle, and he's oft misunderstood. There are days the worst that's in him is the master of the good. But at Christmas, Kindness rules him, and he puts himself aside, and his petty hates are vanquished, and his heart is opened wide. Now, I don't know how to say it, but it somehow seems to me that at Christmas man is almost what God made him to be.